Hello, today we're going to fly this drone in the rain. Probably not many people would find it logical to fly a drone in the rain, but we'll just see how well this drone would resist water and rain. And just for curiosity, can a drone fly in the rain? We have a pretty good drain here, and we'll try to fly it into the rain. I would say that first element that would fail in the drones when they get into water is the turn on and turn off button. There are metal contacts in there and uh, usually when water gets in this element stops working, the switch stops working and then you can't just turn on the drone or you turn it on and you cannot turn it off and from there you can't just fly the drone. Then the next thing that would fail would be the electrical motors that are inside here. When water gets in they would rust and would stop rotating. The axles of the electrical motors would stop rotating. In this case the drone won't fall into water but if it falls into water then the internal circuits are affected. But let's see what rain can do to a drone. Let's start flying it now. So now I put this drain on the ground and I will fly it up. Windy, still flying. Well, surprisingly, it's still flying. I thought it will fall down actually, but it is flying. Now I am not even touching it, and it is even able to maintain it in one position. Now this is actually E88, it has a camera in the bottom that helps to maintain it in one position. We have a little bit of wind but it's still working. It's still flying and working fine. It's not touching anything and it's flying. And the rain is pretty good. Well, I'm surprised by the result, it's still flying. Of course, the consequences will come later when water gets into the circuit via the turn on and turn off button. And when water gets into the electrical motors, they're so small that you can't really clean them or dry them. Maybe you can dry them with a dryer, but we'll see how it goes. I will then disassemble the drone to see what effect it will have on the drone. The drone is getting pretty wet. I see a lot of drops of water on it. The battery of E88 drone is pretty good and that's why it's flying for so long. Let me check what's happening. It fell down because I wasn't controlling it. I'll try to take off again. And it's still working. Let's take off again. Now it's going aside, I mean the calibration is not working now. I have to correct its position with the remote control. Let me try to calibrate it with the buttons. Now it's, the calibration still works, now I'm not touching it. Now again there's wind.
Well, I think it's pretty good if you're caught in the rain and you don't want to break your drone, it probably will survive a little bit of rain, and a lot of rain actually. Well, it even hits the car and still working. Okay, now the wind has gone, I have to calibrate it again. I'm really surprised. I thought it would go down earlier. Now water is dropping from the arms of the drone. I'm not touching it, just flying on its own. I think it's enough. The experiment has gone really well. I'm really surprised by the results. It's a really good result. I mean, it's wet and it's flying. And the rain is really good. So a lot of water was dropping on the drone.